Hello everybody, and welcome to West Grove, developed by Spring Rabbit. So let's start. Since I have nothing to say about any game I play before any play it, I guess. Starting operating system. Uh -huh. So the usual. Oh. Um, I have no audio. Oh, there we are. Camera box. It is empty. Okay. Alarm clock. The alarm cut off, but the alarm went off this morning. Okay. Seems pretty reasonable. I always carry a camping kit in my backpack. It's cheaper than a hotel. That's actually fair. Need to start folding my clothes. My wardrobe is a mess. Phone call. Hello. Hello. It's Jim. What's up? You done with the West Grove filming for me? Not yet. My camera broke. I just bought a new one. This story can make us some good money, you know. If you need to do the usual, get some crazy guy and pay him like five bucks so we can say he saw the Bigfoot. A flying saucer. Whatever it is this time. All right, I'm heading over there now. As soon as I have all the footage, I will call you back. Okay, talk to you soon. Bye. Clickety-clack. Moving snapshots. Bring the video camera to your eye and press the button. That's all you have to do. Every spontaneous moment, a tweaked nose or cheeky expression can be caught forever on video. The days of rigid formality in front of a camera are gone. See it, shoot it, it's as simple as that. There is, however, nothing simple inside the VC3000. Hmm. I've been I'm I'm clicking every button and nothing. Okay, that that'll work. So where's this camera that we're supposed to have? Open the door. I need to change my clothes. Okay. Didn't that what we tried? Changed clothes. <laughs> okay. Oh, and grab my backpack. I apologize. Backpack. Perfect. Now we can leave. We've been good. Okay. What ha what is this place? How long did I sleep? Damn driver dropped me off in the industrial zone. I must be high. I must be behind the town. The road looks empty. I don't think I'll be able to get a ride here. Yeah, this does look like it'd be a pretty empty area. So why don't we try the building with a maniacal smile on it? That's perfect. This factory looks abandoned. Abandoned. The graffiti on the door is creepy. Not really, in my opinion. It kind of looked like a cool smile. Ooh, a hole in the fence. What better way to test our survival skills than go meet this? Go meet it? I don't know. Seems to have seems to have an entrance. Maybe I could go through the forest to get to town. Yeah, or you can, you know, find your last words first. What are these trees doing? What are these trees? Folded over graphics, man. You got to work on this. That's not supposed to be like that, but I don't think so. Okay. That's, um... That's totally normal. Scarecrow is bizarre. Maybe there's, a, maybe there's a farm nearby, and they discard it. Discarded it. Whoa. This is strange with the trees. It's very strange. Wow. A wall. I haven't seen that before. Pardon? Okay, it wasn't the scarecrow, but there's something. What's all this? I don't know. My bet is that we run all the way here and then something happens. Be perfect explanation for anything. One big rock. Pretty average rock. Trees, more trees. Weird rock under a tree. Mario tunnel rusted out. These trees are very strange. It's really weird when they swoop down like that. I could tell it's meant to be like that. But at the same time, I've seen glitches like this, so who knows? All right, we have no more trail, but there is just a mud spot here. Better set up camp here. Yeah, perfect. Tomorrow morning, I arrive in town to finish filming. 
Need to find some sticks to light the fire. I think I could find some further on. Yes, absolutely. Let's find you some sticks. The foggy abyss of nature seemed like a good idea, but apparently that's not a valuable option. Is this it? Oh, yeah. Through the tunnel of the trees and the, the weird morphing branches and whatnot. Aha! Perfect bundle of sticks that are very wobbly. <laughs> they shake so much. Bring it back to the fire. We are back. Put those sticks on the campfire. We grab the lighter that's shaped like a block of chalk. And we light it. Now I can rest for a while. I'd better pack my things inside the tent. Yes. Let us do. Pick it up. Pick it up. I had to go in the tent. <laughs> Looks like it's already dark. I just want to smoke a cigarette and eat something. Where's my cigarette pack? I must have left it in my backpack. Why don't we check? It's not here. Must have fallen out of my pocket. Must have fallen out of my pocket at the bus stop. I can't concentrate without my cigarette. I think if I get my flashlight, I can go out there real quick. At least I'll use it for something. Yeah, but that's not gonna be a valuable option for me, personally. Oh, I thought it zoomed in. I, it was waiting to show me a spooky demon or something. This looks like the uh, texture and thing for the Sea Bear video. Like the Spongebob remake. If you haven't seen that yet, it's it's different. I'm nervous now because now we can walk through this path. And what am I going to see here? Okay. Just a glitch in the ground. That that that's okay. Birds chirping. Can ignore that. Be alright. There's nothing after us, right? We're just going to look for some cigarettes. I know I hear something. Hey! You. You're in a different spot than before so we're gonna ignore that did I take the wrong way I'm pretty sure this was the right way how did that wall get there looks like it has some newspapers pasted on it old newspaper April 6 1932 missing since December 14 1931 <laughs> uh, 17 year old student Helen Baker disappeared three months ago the police found her dress yesterday morning without any rips or marks which indicates that she took it off herself January 22nd, 1933. Several residents are moving out of Darryl, Dairy Field. A debate rage, rages at Town Hall to decide the town's future. Oops. And illegible? Missing. Henry Simmons, 13 years old, black hair, brown eyes. Volunteer searchers find no trace of Thomas Lewis. Local Dairy Field police believe that the man fled on account of some gambling debts. Thomas's family does not believe this version. Uh, did I look through them all? I'm confused on what to do. I must have missed it. Damn, I'm starving. I better try to find my way back to camp. That's all I wanted to read. I just clicked, clicked right through there. Savage. I, I don't understand. My run is like a slight walk. But we're making our way slowly but surely back to camp. Hopefully. Unless Mr. Scarecrow Man's going to come after me. Which I would not appreciate, but... You know, so be it if it happens. 
As long as nobody's behind me. Okay, we good. We good. Yeah, my campfire's still there. As fake as ever. But it's okay. Thank God I managed to find the camp. Hope my lunch is still in my backpack. Your lunch is... Peanut butter? Am I going to the tent? I don't need to enter the tent now. What the heck are we going to do? Oh, yeah, it's peanut butter sandwich. I think I might go a little further. Wait. So, you want to film the creepiness? You want that for yourself? What exactly am I filming with? We already been that way. We haven't been this way. Which gives me more of a reason to believe that I'm going to perish. The forest is where I meet my doom. Maybe this building. Yeah, this is the house of a serial killer. We are now inside the house of a serial killer. Even better. Hello? Anyone home? Another old newspaper. February 2nd, 1933. Town of Derryfield on the brink of bankruptcy. Mayor Frank Barnes declined to interview. Well, what a guy. Nothing interesting. Just a cupboard. Too rusty to open. Okay. We shall not explore that room any further. There's just more rooms. That's that's what freaks me out. That's a mattress. Maybe this will be useful. I found a hanger. Oh, good for you. Oh, yeah. We, we got the hanger. It's hard to see anything. The door's a little cracked. I can see the hinge on the side, too. Maybe I can unscrew that somehow. So you see inside of there. Do I have an inventory? Okay. Um, maybe it's in the uh, room back here and I gotta find something. Nothing interesting. It's a sink. I have a chair. Yeah, there's just not much to go after right now. old rags but we got I'm confused door is stuck maybe I can film something through the keyhole it's too hard to see anything the door's a little cracked I could see the hinge on that side too maybe I can unscrew it somehow do I give the door to Jimmy by the hand no stop stop peeking through there somebody's gonna sp okay <sighs> This is confusing. I don't know where on the door he wants me to go. <clears throat> okay. We're going to look for something that's going to get this door open. We're not backing down. Mainly because I don't have a choice because this game is going to make me either way. But we have to try it, right? What are we going to unscrew it with? Strange ball. <gasps> it's a secret room with blood in it. And a screwdriver. And an old paper. She locked me here now because I managed to escape from the basement. I heard Ralph calling me, but it was the scarecrow. I think she could see through its eyes. I tried to find my way to the town, but the forest seems different every minute. And the night never seems to end. I found this screwdriver behind the house. This is my only hope to get out of here alive. That's kind of a sign that we ain't making it. Yeah. We, uh, we finna, we finna be living here forever, but not living. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that door just, <laughs> it had no business just, pfft. it's not working. Well, that sucks. Old shelf. It's empty. The subtitles just remind me of like an old cranky person, like when you're ex when you're asking questions about their stuff. What's this do? It's broken. February 26, 1933. Yeah, I keep bumping the microphone. 
This Sunday, the population rate dairy field has been updated, and it is estimated to have dropped approximately 86% since 1932. Mayor Frank Barnes finally speaks out about the case, and as the last resort, he reached a cons consensus to rename the town of Dairyfield to Westgrove in hopes to attract new tourists and residents. Okay. That's, that's okay. Oh, you want me to go through that door? Um... Uh, Do we leave? Yeah, we leaving, bro. We out. We out. Back to camp. Back to camp. We going back. We we out. I knew there was going to be something behind that one door. I didn't expect it to be that damn loud, but we made it. <laughs> Something tells me I'm about to be in danger. Do I speak to one of you? Am I allowed to make a movement? Um. See, I don't exactly know what to do from here because... You know, uh, I really don't want to turn around and get jump scared, but we're going to do it anyway. Okay. That, uh, that was Westgrove, I guess. So <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed this video. It was, uh, it was a very decent game. I, I did like it. So that, that's all I have. Have a nice night. Also, vote for the next series on this channel. You have the choice between Little Nightmares and The Walking Dead. If you want to vote, the way you do it is in the description below. There is a instruction on how to vote. Please do such thing. I'm very bored. This channel needs more to it than just scary games. It needs a little bit more. Well, I guess the only games I picked were scary games. But uh, anyway, vote for your favorite or something that you want to see. And we will see you in the next one.